let me just mute that for a minute because I always get copyrighted on that fucking part no matter what. Okay, here we go. No matter what, that intro, that good intro, that classic GTA 4 intro, I always get copyrighted no matter what. Okay, so I do believe I left off, uh, before I, I, I think I left off either on a Fausti mission, no, not a Fausti mission. We killed Faustin, so now we're gonna go, now we're gonna go hit up Brucey for our second mission in his, um, sort of his jobs, pause. Two, three, three, thirty-five. There's someone here to see you. I'm working out. Six, six. Hey, Brucey. Nico. One second. Yeah, this dude takes too. He is too much juice, man. Too much juice. Why didn't you tell me it was Nico? Why? Man, women. Man, women. Yeah. You can always tell because they have a lot of fucking energy with like nothing yeah. to say. Man, I'm ready for you. I'm ready. I'm ready for fucking anything. Are you all right? You seem a little tense. Yeah. Sorry, I'm, I'm just juicing. Makes me a little pent up. Juicing? Yeah. <laughs> Bullshark testosterone. He's people. like, what's Porter that? Online from Chile. Makes you feel really male. <laughs> hey, be careful, man. I heard that stuff does funny things to your balls. Hey, do I look like I got funny balls to you? <laughs> I haven't considered it. Uh, you sent me a message. What do you want? I want help! Hey, what the hell you want? here! Pause. <laughs> Shitty, man. Now look, I did really good with that thing. A lot of people are very grateful. Now listen, that guy Lyle had a car once stealing. Can we get it? Okay, so now we do a street race. We pull off a street race right here. If you're very like last of course. Any risks? Easy as can be. Okay, uh, I'll just go take care of it. Bye, whoever the hell you are. All right, let's see. I should hitch a cab. Which would be the best bet? Oh, Fucking, I was totally in the GTA online mindset. I'm like, you know, what? I'm just going to call my mechanic. But we in the olden days in this one. I'll just grant theft auto it. Most reliable form of transportation in the game. You better not say it, damn thing. Unless that's your car. <laughs> So now we can hear that classic GTA 4 uh, G, um, GPS voice. That's always like the, the little nuances like that always make could just make a game classic. And I remember too like Back then, in like 2008, if you had a GPS in your car, you were kind of like balling. Now everybody has like a little screen in their car, which kind of looks like the GPS screens. Walk around and get the car. Walk around. Walk around. Yeah, we get cut off here. So I was wrong again. We don't get to street race on this one in the comet. That ain't your car. So? 
This is GTA, man. What the fuck? Alright, let's get up out of here. Is that dude after us? No, there's like three dudes after us. Oh, shit! Oh, shit! I'm sorry, lady. This car is going to be fucked. I don't know what Brucey expects, but... If he expects a clean car with no bullet holes in it, he's going to be pleasantly disappointed. And no hood. I don't know what the fuck this guy thinks. Oh my god! And they're like precision drivers on this fucking game too. Dude, this shit's about to explode. I don't know what the fuck Brucey expects. And it might not have been good driving on my part either. Cop, help! Really? Really, dude? Fuck! Come on, flip back over. Okay. Yeah, Bruce, you're gonna... Good thing you're, you have, like, an auto shop, because... Ain't no way this shit is... Coming back clean. Brucey asked me to bring this by. You're lucky it looks as good as it does. The only thing Brucey thinks is good looking is himself in the mirror. Thanks. Dave. All right, now I'm thinking I. Pay a, pay a visit to the gun shop. Get my ammo up. The car is in your lockup. It was not so easy. People were waiting for me. Shit, man. If I don't be like that, I'm gonna get it. You're a fucking brute. I mean, you're cool, though. You made it, man. You got the mad red army trying to kill. I'll throw you out with some big rings. I'm sure you would, Brucey. I'm sure you would. We're all about conflict resolution in here, pal. Okay, so we can't buy any of the cool guns yet. And there's this fucking snake. Dimitri, you got my money? I have it! Meet me at the warehouse of Magalan in downtown Broker. Come along. Oh shit, okay. Shit's about to hit the fan. Okay, hold up. Oh shit! This cannot be real! Take me to the mission objective. I get it. Okay, so take me to the mission objective. I love the taxis in this game because they're sort of a mode of tra fast travel. So yeah, it was a good thing that I went to the gun store. I guess if you pay a visit to the gun store or the gun shop and like the food place after every mission, I think you'll be good. Shot by, huh? You don't know. I'm seeing stuff. Our boy Little Jacob's here to help us because he suspected something. He has our back, you could tell. Hey, Nico! 
Glad you could make it. Yes. You got the money? Sure. But I just wanted to say how grateful me and my bosses are for what you did. Good. Yes. And I just wanted to check something with you. Okay. You are Nico Bellic, correct? What is this? And you used to work the coast in the Mediterranean, smuggling people into Italy. I don't know what you're talking about. But you messed up. And left a lot of bad debt. You left a good friend of mine out of pocket. Big time. Hello, Nico. Oh shit. Hello. Bulgarin. Mr. Bulgarin. Yes. Where is our money? I don't know. I didn't rob you. Really? We were busted Look at this Jeremy Piven looking ass boy I behind Nico. My life. I don't know what happened. I nearly drowned. Huh. My heart was bleeding. I did my best. I didn't fuck up. Well, there you are. Oh, yeah. oh fuck. <laughs> Shootout time. I need my gun. Headshots only, headshots only. They do have armor here, but I mean... There's a lot more than I expected. Look at this. This coward's running. Bomba clot! Where the hell's the armor? Oh, there it is. Nice, Jacob. I'm not gonna end this soon. Let's go! Run! Get in your car and let's run! Hurry up! How would you feel if somebody just got in your car and drove? I wouldn't be mad, especially in this situation. Juke him! Uh, it's like, what do you think I'm trying to do? Oh shit, there's a cop car right there with no cops in it. Okay, so now... You have to stay out of the circle for like five seconds. One. Two, three, four, five. Cops are gone. Oh shit. He loves this cafe, doesn't he? Horrible driving on my part today. Pause! No, we got to though. Dimitri's a fucking snake. Fuck Dimitri. You keep on alone, call me woman and get out of this place. Hey, thanks for your help, Jacob. One love, my brother. No, we have to get our lick back. Because he tried to kill us back there. Okay, so now we probably have to wait for some more phone calls to come in. Mission givers. But we do have a message. Let's see. 
Brucey, ice cold motherfucker like you should look into doing some vigilante work for the for money. Cops are outsourcing that shit to private contractors. Check it out next time you hack a police computer. And what is this? Some vigilante work. Oh, okay. Bro, come see me at my crib. Do we have any more messages? It looks like we do. Okay, so no more messages. I mean, I could do some side missions, but I mean, I don't know. They're not, they're a little redundant. They're not really intricate to the story. The, the story is really fucking good. I mean, I feel like the main missions themselves with the main mission stories just kind of hold their own weight. Like throughout, I, I mean, the side missions are kind of like a quest you could do on your own. Maybe you could do like a stream, talk about like my GTA 6 uh, predictions in it or something. Like on some Mr. Lost for the Fail shit. Wait, little Jacob said what? Cha! I still vex about that dog heart Dimitri. You got them rude driving skills to get I and I away from there. Keep your head down and I keep in touch. Easy, LJ. That was some horrible patois, but that's not my that's not my native language. And I can admit that. So we don't really have a mission giver, do we? No, I don't. It doesn't look like it. Do I have to, like, call one of these guys or something? Maybe I call Michelle? No, not Michelle. Because <laughs> now I'm just driving around listening to a rap. I mean... There's nothing going on. I could give my GTA 6 predictions right now. Oh, look, never mind. There's... Is that Batman? I mean, I guess we're going to have to do a fucking Batman mission. Unless I get out of the car and wait for, like, a phone call. Guess I'll do a Batman mission. We're already here. Hey, my dude. Wagwan. Uh, hey, hey. Oh, yeah, go on, I can know who is good boy. Chuck, get on who is. Batman, what's up? Boy, I'm a day road boy. I said, no one can't test me, no road boy. No one can't test me. See? Who's testing you? Them slibber, slabber Russian type, my youth. <laughs> yeah? Death, everything, disrespect. Yo, yeah, road boy, let me tell you something right now. Well, come and stop and drink milk, road boy. I'm never coming for court no call. Right, whatever you say. Yo, road boy, let me tell you something. You say fish could keep their mouth closed, they wouldn't get caught, road boy. Exactly. Oh, that's a good one. Tell you what, let's go hit those Russian fuckers right now. You know what, road boy? Come and we go deal with them boy there right now. Let's go. I like his stuff. Mario, get to your vehicle. Okay, where is little Jacob's car? He said if a fish kept its mouth closed, it wouldn't get caught. That is very, that's a very good one. I'll have to keep that in touch. I almost hit him with the fucking car while reciting him. Sorry, the bad man. All right, the Russian gang members are in alleyways just off the Carrollton Street doing a deal. Take bad man to them. Oh, shit, we just passed it. Oh, there's a blister. I might trade in this old ass fucking car for that. A rude boy. Let's steal this car real quick, rude boy. Oh, look, she. I thought she was opening the door, like, to get out. My bad. He's I, I stole the car, and he's like, righteous. Okay, so since we're doing a side mission, these are my Grand Theft Auto 6 predictions. I think Lucia is going to be a cop. I think she's going to start off as a cop. That's why she has the tra tracker jammer. That's why she has the USB uh, port. Um, that's why she's like a hacker in the game. 
Uh, I think she's going to be a cop. She's going to let Jason out of jail or something. She's going to fall in love with him. They're going to just start robbing shit together. Um, Dre is going to kind of be like a like a Lester type of guy, maybe. Maybe Wyman is. But I do think she's going to be a cop. That's like my bold prediction. Like, I think she's going to start off in like the force. You're going to do You're going to start off like as a cop. And then you're going to be like, it's going to be like an intro. Yeah, we're definitely going to be a cop. We're to take out the rude boys. But yeah, that's my prediction. I think she's going to be a cop. She's going to be like very straight laced. She might even be the protagonist. Like how Michael was like the, it was like Michael's story. Kind of told from like Franklin's point of view. You know what I mean? That's like my prediction. I think she's going to be like, like how like Ray was in Star Wars. Like she was like sort of like the lead, but like John Boyega was like a Jedi too, but he kind of wasn't. Righteous youth, my youth. Them Russian boy cause me no more botheration, rude boy. Respect you. Don't worry about it. Those are my GTA 6 Yo, predictions. I might have more, but just for now, those are them. Do I have a car? Hey, I just shot a whole bunch of people. How are you? <laughs> Where's my car at? Oh, there it is. They gave me a fresh new... Oh, wait, no, never mind. Oh, that would have been bad. Okay, so still no missions givers. I'm pretty sure I don't have to call no one. Oh. Oh shit. Okay, yeah, so shit's hitting the fan now. So it's kind of kind of did it good I helped bad man out. <coughs> Excuse me. I only honk because I thought I was going to hit them. I got to start doing that more to the GTA pedestrians. She didn't care. Okay, why was he whispering? Is this the part where we find out... I think this is where we get the reveal. The big reveal. Everyone knows what I'm talking about. Oh, wait, no, never mind. That's not now. What are you doing in there? I got scared. People started going to the house and hanging out. You weren't answering your phone. What happened? We've got a big problem. Dimitri was not a man of his word. So what he did? More or less, everything was fine before yes. you. Yes. Fine, and now this? Thank you. Thanks a lot. It's Vinny. David, what's done is done. Yeah. But there's a bigger problem. It's nice to see Roman. What? That guy I owed money to, Bulgarin. Yes, guy in Europe. Who looks by the other Yeah, yeah, he's here now. Uh, great. I'm sorry. I've ruined your life. No, don't be like that. We, we can find a way out of this. Bunch of idiot rush. I will kill every one of them. No, that's exactly what you won't do. We don't oh, I lost my com we my Corvette. What I just remember this we mission. Uh, we can lay low and start over. <sighs> Please. Come on. Let's go back to the apartment. Yeah, this is where we go to a different borough to live. I think I just went the wrong way. 
I did. <laughs> and my jewelry on. Oh, fuck. The car is smoking too. Any of your cousins have a place we could use out in Bowen? It wouldn't be right if we didn't do some Grand Theft Auto. Oh, this is cool. Oh, it's it's probably Mallory's engagement ring. Cause he was just like selling us the dream of like, oh you have a kid, I'm married. So now here we've come to find that the apartment is on fucking fire. And we have to leave this bitch. Cause look at the, did you see the cab depot? And then now look at the apartment. Oh, I wonder if it'll let me get my car. Fuck that, let's get the Corvette. At least we could take this to the new apartment. This sucks about the cab depot. The apartment, I'm not so, like, but... I wouldn't be so mad about the apartment, but the fucking... Bro, Uber comes out in like 12 years, they'll be good. Just download the app, you'll be good. Just wait 12 years, 2020, pandemic, boom. Download the Uber app. You'll be, you'll be right back in it. Like you never left. He does have a good point, though. Oh shit, that's pretty cool. No, you're not gonna beat me there. At least we got this sweet car, though. We're literally right there. Oh, I have a plan. Now I have two Corvettes. Here we are. 
beginning of our lives again. One for me, one for Roman. See, now we both won. Better apartment, two cars. And a better burrow. Slightly better. Worse? Worse. Not so bad. <laughs> I mean, I don't think we'll be impressing women with a wonderful hot tub, but uh, this looks okay. Yes. Great. Come on, what's, what's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? Where should I start? All right, I'll start with you. What's wrong with you? Fifteen minutes ago, you were cowering in fear because you didn't know what was going to happen. Now, you know everything is shit, and we're going to be killed, and you're all cheerful. I don't get it. I guess I'm an optimist. An idiot, not an optimist. I was bought a broker anyway. I'm glad you turned up and made some Russian killers burn down my oh. home and business. Oh, yeah. Thanks, Nico. Thanks a bunch. Is that better? March. Thank God you're okay. Both of you. We're fucked. We're broke and on the run. No, I'm from up here, Nico. I know a bunch of people who might be able to help out. Why don't you come and meet me at the community center later on? I gotta go to work. Bye, Papi. And have a shower. You smell a little, um, mature. Mature. So, I guess we start again. Sure. I'm going out. Are you just gonna leave him hanging? Oh, it didn't let me keep the other one. That's bullshit. That's bullshit. That's bullshit. That's bullshit. That's bullshit. Oh, look, there's one right there. Okay, so we got a Brucey and a Mallory mission. Which I believe I'm gonna go do the Mallory mission since it's closer. After I park the the Corvette. Yo! Mister! Stop your damn car, man. You know, I might do the Brucey mission because this mission is actually the racing mission. And I think he won't be a mission giver after that. So I think it's best I just knock it out. No, out of the closet. Okay, so this is where we have to just set up the date with French Tom. Nico, you want to go on a date? Uh, come on, what's wrong with you? Okay, who is she? That's the thing, it's a guy. Fuck you. No, dude, listen! <laughs> he was just like, fuck you. Me a lot of money, and the dick won't pay. Instead he said he's gonna have me kill that bitch. Hiya! Oh. Brucey, you got to chill. For real. Yeah. Now listen, Envy. This guy isn't hiding, but he's a serious... He's a serious cock out. Oh, so you think of me? No, but the guy knows me, and I don't think anyone would date that kind of slob. So, I'm just doing your profile. All right, let me see. I am a vulnerable guy who needs to be held by big, strong arms. <laughs> yeah. you got to be kidding me. <laughs> I know we should have made him a giver, not a taker, Bruce. Oh, shut up! <laughs> now, listen, Nikki. I need you. I will pay heavily for this. <coughs> okay. I'm the Roman. Cousin? You're a dick. You're a dick. <laughs> Nicky! <laughs> Shit. Yeah, Nico's badass. Everyone's everyone gives Nico the respect he deserves. Alright, let's see here. We need to go to Oneida Avenue. Internet Cafe. 
since we live in the 2000s in this game. You should join the Alright man, I'm at the internet cafe. What now? The website is love me. <laughs> Go to it, bro. The guy you want to date with is using French Tom as his screen name. You heard animal, man. Eat him alive, okay? Yeah, I'm gonna go to a computer, like, over here, because that's just, yeah, I don't have to explain that shit. Maybe I find a few dates with some women. Let's see, she looks, let's see, job? She don't have a job, so never mind. Uh, let's see. Analyst, okay, you know them. Smart chicks. Kind of freaky. Let's see. Go get her. Recruiter. Oh, all right. All right. Okay, let's see what else we got on here. Um, yeah, these other girls do not really peak Nico's interest. Maybe this one. Ah, yeah, we'll do it. Seems like an easy win. All right, now we got to go do the French Tom. What the hell does this... I am a vulnerable guy who needs to be held by big, strong... Oh, my God. He really wrote that? A man in need of looking after. I want to be told that I am the only guy in the world. I give a shit ton. I got a shitload of cash, and I want to spend it on the first... I've got so much lettuce, I could open a salad bar. <laughs> what? <laughs> and then girls are going to read that shit, too, so... Need to have big, strong arm to find delts. Weird balls. Dislikes weird balls. People take money and go into hiding and think they ain't whoever going to be found. Joke? Oh. Hot women, titties, all the straight shit. America's top hooker. If they did that show with Rant Boys, maybe I'd watch it. So we have to look for a guy named French Tom. Okay. All right, yeah, let's get the hell up out of here. Allow some time for French Tom to check love me and email you his reply. Okay. So that was a pretty ominous tone for such a gay task. We probably have to kill him. Oh, yeah, we do have to kill him. Yeah, we do. Because he won't pay Brucey. Equality. All right, let's find a cab. Nico Bellic. We did not find your body with the others in the warehouse. Mr. Bulgarin and I were very disappointed. I was loyal to I'm glad. Why did you turn on me? You think I could survive in a city like this by aligning myself with a bottom feeder like you? killed Faustin. It was not my choice. I will find you, Nico. I have burnt you and your cousin out of Hall of Peach. I will smoke you out of any other hiding place you have in this city. See you soon, Nico. I'm back in Hove Beach like I never left. I'm here now. Pull up. But it, it doesn't work that way in this game. Alright, let's go check out the Manny mission with this douchebag. This is probably the most annoying fucking character in this game. He reminds me of someone I've met in my real life. Who's actually named Manny and looks exactly like this guy named Manny. And whenever he gets... Like, when they get him up out of there, I'm actually happy. This is the one that we're gonna get a really nice shot of them. It's gonna be beautiful. I mean, you okay. caught him. He's moving. No. But we wanna make sure that we see them. Okay. okay we wanna see you. Just feel it, man. Okay, well, just keep looking at me, but stand over there. Okay? You can hear? Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Very cool. Good. Okay. Yeah, Go. Beautiful. 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 All right. You ready for this? Yes, I am. Turn this way. I actually had a manager who looked yes, like this guy, and he was a total douchebag. Right over here. Let me see you work. This way. Yes. Good. Good. Perfect. Cool, cool, cool. So how do I look, man? You look good. Do I look gay? No, no, no. It's an experimental <laughs> kind of dance. Okay. So here we go then. Yeah. See, it's the streets, man. But people gotta understand the struggles. For real. You know what I'm saying? 
They gotta understand the struggles. Yeah. Oh, hey, Nico. <laughs> yeah, and this guy totally acts like his shit don't stink, but he's like totally fake. He reminds me of my old manager. That's why you don't mind doing it. The guy who just lost his home and his business, and now has a price on his head. Pretty good. <laughs> I love his optimism. So, Nico, this is Manny. We grew up together. Hey, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we have to go and kill people, and he acts like he did it. This is a lot of rappers these days. A street accomplice? Whoops. Shouldn't have had it all in my face, dude. Thank you very Pause. much. Pause. for today. Thanks a lot. What are you doing? What are you saying? We're, we got to get some of these dealers off the streets, man. You know? You mean I, I got to get these dealers off the streets, you dickhead? Me when you're doing it. Well, that's my testimony, man. Look, brother, would you help, please? Look, I got money. Yeah. I got I got money. In which case, you've got to help. Yes. Good. All right. Hey, how's the camera? It's not good. What do you mean it's not good? Can Just don't papers? even... Okay. All right, okay, well, listen, look. This dude's we're tired of his shit, these too. Up the streets, and we're gonna kick their ass, and they're gonna know what's me. Call if we're gonna clean these streets. Well, the game's called Grand Theft Auto for a reason. Let's get this ugly-ass car. You're gonna... You hit me. I should fuck you up. Get out of the car. I'm coming up you. Last I heard, these dealers was up on Grand Boulevard. Let's go take a look, man. NB, I've been in touch with Roman to get here soon. We need the three most dangerous blinking hardcore motherfuckers in the whole of Liberty City to be rolling in the same room together for real. B. I just ran into a cop reading your dumbass message about testosterone fueled delusions. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, no, no more, no, no, come on, no more, no, 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 no more, no, 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 fuck! Ugh. Come on, dude, I just need to get from point A to point B, you don't have to chase me. That's not how it works. Just kidding, yeah, that's how it works. Alright, leave me. All right, I got out of the circle, so maybe the fuck off. Go to the dealer's place with Manny. Okay, yeah, so I have to go kill some people and act like he did it. Which is a lot of this game. I mean, Nico is ending crime families for other crime families single fucking handedly. While they take all the credit for it when it was just Nico doing it. Very impressive work in the GTA universe. That's like fucking curing cancer. Oh, we. So we had to still tell him, okay. How does he not see us? <laughs> hey, B, we got to follow him to them other leeches, man. They be sucking the damn life out of these streets. Pause. All right, let's follow him. Follow the dealer to the meat. Don't let him know you're following him. I was like, I was on his ass. Pause. Yeah, we have to tell him. I'm not used to telling people. My bad. I thought we had to fucking chase him. Hey cop, just telling somebody here. No 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 worries. Man, 
This doesn't look fucking conspicuous at all. At all. He totally sees us. Yeah, go ahead, dude. Go down the road, and I'm following. That's basically what the fuck is this is. Just with you as the figurehead. To be an annoying dickhead, probably. That stupid car in front is holding up the whole fucking mission. And I want to go ram it out of the way, but that'll like fail, I think. Try not to get copyrighted by anything. Hopefully they fix that in GTA 6. Well, they, they fixed it in GTA 5. Like the driving AI where like they're not so stupid. But there's something about like dumb NPCs that's cool. But at the same time, it's just more of like an aesthetic pleasure. Yeah, so here we go. Episode one, Nico Bellic Street Justice. I, I Nico Bellic, take out the all hey, these the drug dealers. And supplier. Yeah, you could have this ugly ass car. It fits you perfectly. I'll probably take this dude's car after like I'm done here. So have at it. Wrong warehouse, bitch. Damn you! What is that? They shot the shit out of me. I wondered why it was auto locking there. I thought it was auto locking on the on the sprung. Shit! Somebody has a shotgun. It doesn't hurt to buy a soda or some snacks. Get that health back. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna need one more. Dude had a shotgun. 
This fake ass motherfucker. The real hero showed up. Go fuck yourselves. That's funny. Was it a good mixture of that sadness and resolve? You looked great. Great, yeah. Let's do it. Okay, from the top? Yeah, right here. Wait, where, where are you going? Ah. More senseless death than the police aren't even here yet. Help has only one name on the streets of South Bowen. Many Escobilla. That's right. Follow me. We'll be prepared. Street life ain't pretty. I wonder if he's related to Javier Escuela. Probably not. <laughs> Okay, so it looks like we have to do another mission for that annoying prick Manny, which I'm down to finish all of them soon. Like, I'm down to do those missions and get them out of the way. So streets. Okay, guys, I just want to get one more shot, please. It's gonna look great. Right Something. Here. I don't know. The stupid okay, record thing is in the way. Time. It's gonna be great. Okay, thank you. A little closer. Uh, thank right. you so much. Cool. <laughs> wonderful, Thanks. wonderful, uh, beautiful. Now we are gonna be. Uh, da, 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 da. Yeah, all I can say is I hope you'll continue to make the community. Give it okay. up. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Officer McCree, this is Nico right here. This is my man, Nico. Oh, good to meet you. Uh, I hear you're helping this guy with his vital work for our city. Oh, no, I'm uh, just a tourist. Uh, look, <laughs> I'm go. All right. just doing a tourist. What you're doing. Thank you, officer. Thanks. Yeah, you know, it was a real big thing for me, you know what I'm saying? A real street cat to start working with the gatekeepers of the community to make things better. I mean, where I'm from, out here, man, police, it's a dirty word, man. Manny, you know? I got things to do. You, off. Yo, man, I was just getting my flow on, man. I ain't rock for years. I was one of them cats who invented that shit, man. It went commercial. Yeah, like charity work. Shit, man, I'm the voice of the streets, man. Yo, if I'm gonna make some money, that's the way shit's gonna be. All right, I'm just saying. Whatever, man, fucking punk. Huh. Yo, listen, oh boy, I, I need you to do me a favor, man. Listen, man, I need you to help me out, man. I need you to get some bitches taken out, moved on, whatever. Because, yo, I promised Mr. McCready I was going to get this place cleaned up, and I will. Okay, how many? A bunch, man, a bunch. They're hanging out and making bad shit happen all over South Bohan, man. They're over on Windmill Street right now. All right. What did they do? Man, they disrespected the codes of the streets, man. The streets, man, they owe you, man. They owe you big time. As long as they pay. Over here, man. I'm on you. Yo, that's what I'm saying, man. Streets, we got codes, man. Okay, I can't hear this guy talk anymore. <clears throat> so. Wait, never mind, dude. I wanted a taxi instead. What? That was a weird fucking insult. Oh, damn, I fucked myself. I should have. Wait, wait, wait. No, 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 no. Wait, hold up, dude. Hold up, hold up. Come here. Come back here. Come back here. I didn't even follow my own rule. Yeah, I'm gonna need some more weapons before I do this shit. And a car. So wait your ass right there. We're all about conflict resolution in here, pal.
Okay, now that we're told that we can go back to the mission. Oh wait, no. Okay. Now that um, we're there, we'll probably have to find a car somewhere. Because I know one of them tries to drive off unless I just shoot the guy right there next to the car. All right, got him. <clears throat> All right, so I just have to call that annoying prick Manny. Okay, so it looks like now we have to wait for a call from Mallory, then we get introduced to Elizabeta. Then we get introduced to Elizabeta is when we get introduced to Johnny Klebitz. Um, also, uh, Packy McCreary, which will probably be in the next stream.